In quantum mechanics, the Schrödinger equation is a mathematical equation that describes the changes over time of a physical system in which quantum effects, such as wave-particle duality, are significant. These systems are referred to as quantum mechanical systems. The equation is considered a central result in the study of quantum systems, and its derivation was a significant landmark in the development of the theory of quantum mechanics. It was named after Erwin Schrödinger, who derived the equation in 1925, and published it in 1926, forming the basis for his work that resulted in him being awarded the Nobel Prize in Physics in 1933. In classical mechanics, Newton's second law F equals ma is used to make a mathematical prediction as to what path a given physical system will take over time following a set of known initial conditions. Solving this equation gives the position, and the momentum of the physical system as a function of the external force F on the system. Those two parameters are sufficient to describe its state at each time instant. In quantum mechanics, the analog of Newton's law is Schrödinger's equation for a quantum system usually atoms, molecules, and subatomic particles whether free, bound, or localized. The equation is mathematically described as a linear partial differential equation, which describes the time evolution of the system's wave function also called a state function. The concept of a wave function is a fundamental postulate of quantum mechanics, that defines the state of the system at each spatial position, and time. Using these postulates, Schrödinger's equation can be derived from the fact that the time evolution operator must be unitary, and must therefore be generated by the exponential of a self-adjoint operator, which is the quantum Hamiltonian. This derivation is explained below. In the Copenhagen interpretation of quantum mechanics, the wave function is the most complete description that can be given of a physical system. Solutions to Schrödinger's equation describe not only molecular, atomic, and subatomic systems, but also macroscopic systems, possibly even the whole universe. Schrödinger's equation is central to all applications of quantum mechanics including quantum field theory which combines special relativity with quantum mechanics. Theories of quantum gravity, such as string theory, also do not modify Schrödinger's equation. The Schrödinger equation is not the only way to study quantum mechanical systems and make predictions, as there are other quantum mechanical formulations such as matrix mechanics, introduced by Werner Heisenberg, and path integral formulation, developed chiefly by Richard Feynman. Paul Dirac incorporated matrix mechanics and the Schrödinger equation into a single formulation. Topic. Equation. Time-dependent equation The form of the Schrödinger equation depends on the physical situation see below for special cases. The most general form is the time-dependent Schrödinger equation TDSE, which gives a description of a system evolving with time, where I is the imaginary unit, H is the reduced Planck constant, equals H 2 pi Display style h b a r equals frac h two pi. The symbol d d t indicates a derivative with respect to time t. Psi, the Greek letter psi, is the state vector of the quantum system. R and t are the position vector and time respectively, and h is the Hamiltonian operator, which characterizes the total energy of the system under consideration. The position space wave function of the quantum system is nothing but the components in the expansion of the state vector in terms of the position eigenvector r display style vert math bf r wrangle it is a scalar function expressed as psi r t equals r psi Display style psi math bf r t equals Langle math bf r vert psi wrangle. Similarly, the momentum space wave function can be defined as psi tilde p t equals p psi. Display style tilde psi math bf p t equals Langle math bf p vert psi wrangle. Where p display style vert math bfp wrangle is the momentum eigenvector. The most famous example is the non-relativistic Schrödinger equation for the wave function in the position basis. 
psi r t display style psi math bf r t of a single particle moving in a potential v r t display style v math bf r t for example the electric field created by a second particle usually much heavier particle but not a magnetic field see the pauli equation smiley face where mu is the particles reduced mass V is its potential energy, 2 is the Laplacian a differential operator, and ψ is the wave function more precisely, in this context, it is called the position space wave function. In plain language, it means total energy equals kinetic energy plus potential energy, but the terms take unfamiliar forms for reasons explained below. Given the particular differential operators involved, this is a linear partial differential equation. It is also a diffusion equation, but unlike the heat equation, this one is also a wave equation given the imaginary unit present in the transient term. The term, Schrödinger equation, can refer to both the general equation, or the specific nonrelativistic version. The general equation is indeed quite general, used throughout quantum mechanics, for everything from the Dirac equation to quantum field theory, by plugging in diverse expressions for the Hamiltonian. The specific nonrelativistic version is a strictly classical approximation to reality and yields accurate results in many situations, but only to a certain extent see relativistic quantum mechanics and relativistic quantum field theory. To apply the Schrödinger equation, the Hamiltonian operator is set up for the system, accounting for the kinetic and potential energy of the particles constituting the system, then inserted into the Schrödinger equation. The resulting partial differential equation is solved for the wave function, which contains information about the system. Time-independent equation The time-dependent Schrödinger equation described above predicts that wave functions can form standing waves, called stationary states also called orbitals, as in atomic orbitals or molecular orbitals. These states are particularly important as their individual study later simplifies the task of solving the time-dependent Schrödinger equation for any state. Stationary states can also be described by a simpler form of the Schrödinger equation, the time-independent Schrödinger equation TISE, where E is a constant equal to the total energy of the system. This is only used when the Hamiltonian itself is not dependent on time explicitly. However, even in this case the total wave function still has a time dependency. In words, the equation states When the Hamiltonian operator acts on a certain wave function ψ, and the result is proportional to the same wave function ψ, then ψ is a stationary state, and the proportionality constant, E, is the energy of the state ψ. In linear algebra terminology, this equation is an eigenvalue equation and in this sense the wave function is an eigenfunction of the Hamiltonian operator. As before, the most common manifestation is the nonrelativistic Schrödinger equation for a single particle moving in an electric field but not a magnetic field with definitions as above. The time-independent Schrödinger equation is discussed further below. <laughs> Derivation In the modern understanding of quantum mechanics, Schrödinger's equation may be derived as follows. If the wave function at time t is given by ψ t then by the linearity of quantum mechanics the wave function at time t must be given by ψ t equals u t t ψ T display style psi t equals u t t psi t, where u t t display style u t t is a linear operator. Since time evolution must preserve the norm of the wave function, it follows that u t t display style u t t must be a member of the unitary group of operators acting on wave functions. We also know that when t equals t display style t equals t, we must have 
u t t equals 1 display style u t t equals 1 therefore expanding the operator u t t display style u t t for t close to t we can write u t t equals 1 minus i h t minus t display style u t t equals 1 i h t t where h is a hermitian operator this follows from the fact that the lie algebra corresponding to the unitary group comprises hermitian operators taking the limit as the time difference t minus t display style t t becomes very small we obtain schrodinger's equation so far h is only an abstract hermitian operator however using the correspondence principle it is possible to show that in the classical limit the expectation value of h is indeed the classical energy the correspondence principle does not completely fix the form of the quantum hamiltonian due to the uncertainty principle and therefore the precise form of the quantum hamiltonian must be fixed empirically Implications The Schrödinger equation and its solutions introduced a breakthrough in thinking about physics. Schrödinger's equation was the first of its type, and solutions led to consequences that were very unusual and unexpected for the time. Total, kinetic, and potential energy The overall form of the equation is not unusual or unexpected, as it uses the principle of the conservation of energy. The terms of the nonrelativistic Schrödinger equation can be interpreted as total energy of the system, equal to the system kinetic energy plus the system potential energy. In this respect, it is just the same as in classical physics. Quantization. The Schrödinger equation predicts that if certain properties of a system are measured, the result may be quantized, meaning that only specific discrete values can occur. One example is energy quantization. The energy of an electron in an atom is always one of the quantized energy levels, a fact discovered via atomic spectroscopy. Energy quantization is discussed below. Another example is quantization of angular momentum. This was an assumption in the earlier Bohr model of the atom, but it is a prediction of the Schrödinger equation. Another result of the Schrödinger equation is that not every measurement gives a quantized result in quantum mechanics. For example, position, momentum, time, and in some situations energy can have any value across a continuous range. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Measurement and uncertainty. In classical mechanics, a particle has, at every moment, an exact position and an exact momentum. These values change deterministically as the particle moves according to Newton's laws. Under the Copenhagen interpretation of quantum mechanics, particles do not have exactly determined properties, and when they are measured, the result is randomly drawn from a probability distribution. The Schrödinger equation predicts what the probability distributions are, but fundamentally cannot predict the exact result of each measurement. The Heisenberg uncertainty principle is the statement of the inherent measurement uncertainty in quantum mechanics. It states that the more precisely a particle's position is known, the less precisely its momentum is known, and vice versa. The Schrödinger equation describes the deterministic evolution of the wave function of a particle. However, even if the wave function is known exactly, the result of a specific measurement on the wave function is uncertain. Quantum tunneling In classical physics, when a ball is rolled slowly up a large hill, it will come to a stop and roll back, because it doesn't have enough energy to get over the top of the hill to the other side. However, the Schrödinger equation predicts that there is a small probability that the ball will get to the other side of the hill, even if it has too little energy to reach the top. This is called quantum tunneling. 
It is related to the distribution of energy. Although the ball's assumed position seems to be on one side of the hill, there is a chance of finding it on the other side. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Particles as waves. The nonrelativistic Schrödinger equation is a type of partial differential equation called a wave equation. Therefore, it is often said particles can exhibit behavior usually attributed to waves. In some modern interpretations this description is reversed, the quantum state, i.e. wave, is the only genuine physical reality, and under the appropriate conditions it can show features of particle-like behavior. However, Ballantini shows that such an interpretation has problems. Ballantini points out that whilst it is arguable to associate a physical wave with a single particle, there is still only one Schrödinger wave equation for many particles. He points out, If a physical wave field were associated with a particle, or if a particle were identified with a wave packet, then corresponding to n interacting particles there should be n interacting waves in ordinary three-dimensional space. But according to 4.6, that is not the case. Instead, there is one wave function in an abstract three-n-dimensional configuration space. The misinterpretation of psi as a physical wave in ordinary space is possible only because the most common applications of quantum mechanics are to one-particle states, for which configuration space and ordinary space are isomorphic. Two-slit diffraction is a famous example of the strange behaviors that waves regularly display, that are not intuitively associated with particles. The overlapping waves from the two slits cancel each other out in some locations, and reinforce each other in other locations, causing a complex pattern to emerge. Intuitively, one would not expect this pattern from firing a single particle at the slits, because the particle should pass through one slit or the other, not a complex overlap of both. However, since the Schrödinger equation is a wave equation, a single particle fired through a double slit does show this same pattern figure on right. Note, the experiment must be repeated many times for the complex pattern to emerge. Although this is counterintuitive, the prediction is correct, in particular, electron diffraction and neutron diffraction are well understood and widely used in science and engineering. Related to diffraction, particles also display superposition and interference. The superposition property allows the particle to be in a quantum superposition of two or more quantum states at the same time. However, it is noted that a quantum state in quantum mechanics means the probability that a system will be, for example at a position x, not that the system will actually be at position x. It does not imply that the particle itself may be in two classical states at once. Indeed, quantum mechanics is generally unable to assign values for properties prior to measurement at all. Many worlds interpretation In Dublin in 1952 Erwin Schrödinger gave a lecture in which at one point he jocularly warned his audience that what he was about to say might seem lunatic. It was that, when his equations seem to be describing several different histories, they are not alternatives but all really happen simultaneously. This is the earliest known reference to the many worlds interpretation of quantum mechanics. Interpretation of the wave function The Schrödinger equation provides a way to calculate the wave function of a system and how it changes dynamically in time. However, the Schrödinger equation does not directly say what, exactly, the wave function is. Interpretations of quantum mechanics address questions such as what the relation is between the wave function, the underlying reality, and the results of experimental measurements. An important aspect is the relationship between the Schrödinger equation and wave function collapse. In the oldest Copenhagen interpretation, particles follow the Schrödinger equation except during wave function collapse, during which they behave entirely differently. The advent of quantum decoherence theory allowed alternative approaches such as the Everett many worlds interpretation and consistent histories, wherein the Schrödinger equation is always satisfied, and wave function collapse should be explained as a consequence of the Schrödinger equation. Historical background and development 
Following Max Planck's quantization of light see black body radiation, Albert Einstein interpreted Planck's quanta to be photons, particles of light, and proposed that the energy of a photon is proportional to its frequency, one of the first signs of wave-particle duality. Since energy and momentum are related in the same way as frequency and wave number in special relativity, it followed that the momentum p of a photon is inversely proportional to its wavelength λ, or proportional to its wave number k p equals h lambda equals k display style p equals frac h lambda equals h bar k where h is planck's constant and h is the reduced planck constant h 2 pi lewis de broglie hypothesized that this is true for all particles even particles which have mass such as electrons he showed that, assuming that the matter waves propagate along with their particle counterparts, electrons form standing waves, meaning that only certain discrete rotational frequencies about the nucleus of an atom are allowed. These quantized orbits correspond to discrete energy levels, and de Broglie reproduced the Bohr model formula for the energy levels. The Bohr model was based on the assumed quantization of angular momentum L according to L equals N H two pi equals n display style l equals n h over two pi equals n h bar. According to de Broglie, the electron is described by a wave, and a whole number of wavelengths must fit along the circumference of the electron's orbit. N lambda equals two pi r. Display style n lambda equals 2 pi r. This approach essentially confined the electron wave in one dimension along a circular orbit of radius r. In 1921, prior to de Broglie, Arthur C. Lund at the University of Chicago had used the same argument based on the completion of the relativistic energy momentum four vector to derive what we now call the de Broglie relation. Unlike de Broglie, Lund went on to formulate the differential equation now known as the Schrödinger equation, and solve for its energy eigenvalues for the hydrogen atom. Unfortunately the paper was rejected by the Physical Review, as recounted by Kamen. Following up on de Broglie's ideas, physicist Peter Debye made an off-hand comment that if particles behaved as waves, they should satisfy some sort of wave equation. Inspired by Debye's remark, Schrödinger decided to find a proper three-dimensional wave equation for the electron. He was guided by William R. Hamilton's analogy between mechanics and optics, encoded in the observation that the zero wavelength limit of optics resembles a mechanical system. The trajectories of light rays become sharp tracks that obey Fermat's principle, an analog of the principle of least action. A modern version of his reasoning is reproduced below. The equation he found is I T psi R T equals minus 2 2 m 2 psi r t plus v r psi r t Display style i h b a r frac partial partial t psi math b f r t equals frac h b a r caret two two meters nabla caret two psi math b f r t plus v math b f r psi math b f r t. However, by that time, Arnold Sommerfeld had refined the Bohr model with relativistic corrections. Schrödinger used the relativistic energy momentum relation to find what is now known as the Klein-Gordon equation in a Coulomb potential in natural units E plus E 2 R 2 psi x equals minus 2 psi x plus m 2 psi x display style left e plus e caret 2 over r right caret 2 psi x equals nabla caret 2 psi x plus m caret 2 psi x he found the standing waves of this relativistic equation but the relativistic corrections disagreed with sommerfeld's formula 
Discouraged, he put away his calculations and secluded himself in an isolated mountain cabin in December 1925. While at the cabin, Schrödinger decided that his earlier nonrelativistic calculations were novel enough to publish, and decided to leave off the problem of relativistic corrections for the future. Despite the difficulties in solving the differential equation for hydrogen, he had sought help from his friend the mathematician Hermann Weyl. Schrödinger showed that his nonrelativistic version of the wave equation produced the correct spectral energies of hydrogen in a paper published in 1926. In the equation, Schrödinger computed the hydrogen spectral series by treating a hydrogen atom's electron as a wave psi x t moving in a potential well v created by the proton. This computation accurately reproduced the energy levels of the Bohr model. In a paper, Schrödinger himself explained this equation as follows. This 1926 paper was enthusiastically endorsed by Einstein, who saw the matter waves as an intuitive depiction of nature, as opposed to Heisenberg's matrix mechanics, which he considered overly formal. The Schrödinger equation details the behavior of psi but says nothing of its nature. Schrödinger tried to interpret it as a charge density in his fourth paper, but he was unsuccessful. In 1926, just a few days after Schrödinger's fourth and final paper was published, Max Born successfully interpreted ψ as the probability amplitude, whose absolute square is equal to probability density. Schrödinger, though, always opposed a statistical or probabilistic approach, with its associated discontinuities. Much like Einstein, who believed that quantum mechanics was a statistical approximation to an underlying deterministic theory, and never reconciled with the Copenhagen interpretation, Louis de Broglie in his later years proposed a real valued wave function connected to the complex wave function by a proportionality constant and developed the de Broglie-Bohm theory. Topic: The wave equation for particles. The Schrödinger equation is a variation on the diffusion equation where the diffusion constant is imaginary. A spike of heat will decay in amplitude and spread out, however, because the imaginary I is the generator of rotations in the complex plane, a spike in the amplitude of a matter wave will also rotate in the complex plane over time. The solutions are therefore functions which describe wave-like motions. Wave equations in physics can normally be derived from other physical laws. The wave equation for mechanical vibrations on strings and in matter can be derived from Newton's laws, where the wave function represents the displacement of matter, and electromagnetic waves from Maxwell's equations, where the wave functions are electric and magnetic fields. The basis for Schrödinger's equation, on the other hand, is the energy of the system and a separate postulate of quantum mechanics. The wave function is a description of the system. The Schrödinger equation is therefore a new concept in itself, as Feynman put it, The foundation of the equation is structured to be a linear differential equation based on classical energy conservation, and consistent with the de Broglie relations. The solution is the wave function ψ, which contains all the information that can be known about the system. In the Copenhagen interpretation, the modulus of ψ is related to the probability the particles are in some spatial configuration at some instant of time. Solving the equation for ψ can be used to predict how the particles will behave under the influence of the specified potential and with each other. The Schrödinger equation was developed principally from the de Broglie hypothesis, a wave equation that would describe particles, and can be constructed as shown informally in the following sections. For a more rigorous description of Schrödinger's equation, see also Resnick et al. Consistency with energy conservation The total energy E of a particle is the sum of kinetic energy T and potential energy V. This sum is also the frequent expression for the Hamiltonian H in classical mechanics. E equals T plus V equals H Display style E equals T plus V equals H. Explicitly, for a particle in one dimension with position x, mass m and momentum p, and potential energy V which generally varies with position and time t, E equals P 2 2 m plus V x t equals H 
Display style e equals frac p caret two two meters plus v x t equals h. For three dimensions, the position vector r and momentum vector p must be used. E equals p p two m plus v r t equals h. Display style e equals frac math bf p c d o t math bf p two meters plus v math bf r t equals h. This formalism can be extended to any fixed number of particles. The total energy of the system is then the total kinetic energies of the particles plus the total potential energy. Again, the Hamiltonian. However, there can be interactions between the particles an n-body problem, so the potential energy V can change as the spatial configuration of particles changes, and possibly with time. The potential energy, in general, is not the sum of the separate potential energies for each particle, it is a function of all the spatial positions of the particles. Explicitly, E equals N equals 1 N P N P N two M N plus V R one R two R N T equals H Display style e equals sum underscore n equals one caret n frac math bf p underscore n c d o t math bf p underscore n two meters underscore n plus v math bf r underscore one math bf r underscore two c d o t s math bf r underscore n t equals h. Topic linearity. The simplest wave function is a plane wave of the form psi r t equals a e i k r minus omega t. Display style psi math bf r t equals a caret i math bf k c d o t math bf r omega t where the a is the amplitude, k the wave vector, and omega the angular frequency, of the plane wave. In general, physical situations are not purely described by plane waves, so for generality the superposition principle is required. Any wave can be made by superposition of sinusoidal plane waves. So if the equation is linear, a linear combination of plane waves is also an allowed solution. Hence a necessary and separate requirement is that the Schrödinger equation is a linear differential equation. For discrete k the sum is a superposition of plane waves psi r t equals n equals 1 infinity a n e i k n r minus omega n t Display style psi math bf r t equals sum underscore n equals one caret n a t o underscore n e caret i math bf k underscore n c d o t math bf r omega underscore n t for some real amplitude coefficients n and for continuous k the sum becomes an integral the Fourier transform of a momentum space wave function psi r t equals 1 2 pi 3 phi k e i k r minus omega t d 3 k Display style psi math bf r t equals frac 1 sqrt 2 pi caret 3 int phi math bf k e caret i math bf k c d o t math bf r omega t d caret 3 math bf k 
where d3 k equals d k x d k y d k z is the differential volume element in k space, and the integrals are taken over all k space. The momentum wave function phi k arises in the integrand since the position and momentum space wave functions are Fourier transforms of each other. Equals. Topic: Consistency with the de Broglie relations. Equals. Einstein's light quanta hypothesis 1905 states that the energy E of a photon is proportional to the frequency nu or angular frequency omega equals 2 pn of the corresponding quantum wave packet of light E equals h nu equals omega display style E equals h nu equals h bar omega Likewise de Broglie's hypothesis 1924 states that any particle can be associated with a wave, and that the momentum p of the particle is inversely proportional to the wavelength λ of such a wave or proportional to the wave number k equals 2 pi, λ, in one dimension, by p equals h λ equals k Display style p equals frac h lambda equals h bar k. While in three dimensions, wavelength lambda is related to the magnitude of the wave vector k. P equals k k equals two pi lambda. Display style math bf p equals h bar math bf k quad math bf k equals frac two pi lambda. The Planck-Einstein and de Broglie relations illuminate the deep connections between energy with time and space with momentum, and express wave-particle duality. In practice, natural units comprising h equals one are used, as the de Broglie equations reduce to identities, allowing momentum, wave number, energy, and frequency to be used interchangeably to prevent duplication of quantities and reduce the number of dimensions of related quantities. For familiarity, SI units are still used in this article. Schrödinger's insight, late in 1925, was to express the phase of a plane wave as a complex phase factor using these relations. Psi equals a e i k r minus omega t equals a e i p r minus e t Display style psi equals a caret i math bf k c d o t math bf r omega t equals a caret i math bf p c d o t math bf r et h bar. And to realize that the first order partial derivatives were, with respect to space, psi equals i p a e i P R minus E T equals I P psi D I display style nabla psi equals D F R A C I H B A R Math B F P A carrot I Math B F P C D O T Math B F R at H B A R equals D F R A C I H B A R Math B F P psi with respect to time, psi t equals minus i e a e i p r minus e t equals minus i e psi Display style d f r a c partial psi partial t equals d f r a c i e h b a r a caret i math b f p c d o t math b f r at h b a r equals d f r a c i e h b a r psi. 
Another postulate of quantum mechanics is that all observables are represented by linear Hermitian operators which act on the wave function, and the eigenvalues of the operator are the values the observable takes. The previous derivatives are consistent with the energy operator, corresponding to the time derivative e caret psi equals i t psi equals e psi display style hat e psi equals i h b a r d f r a c partial partial t psi equals e psi where e are the energy eigenvalues and the momentum operator corresponding to the spatial derivatives the gradient p caret psi equals minus i psi equals p psi display style hat math bf p psi equals i h bar nabla psi equals math bf p psi where p is a vector of the momentum eigenvalues in the above the hats indicate these observables are operators not simply ordinary numbers or vectors the energy and momentum operators are differential operators, while the potential energy function V is just a multiplicative factor. Substituting the energy and momentum operators into the classical energy conservation equation obtains the operator E equals P P 2 M plus V E caret equals P carrot P carrot 2 M plus V display style e equals DFRAC math BF P C D O T math BF P 2 meters plus V quad right arrow quad hat e equals DFRAC hat math BF P C D O T hat math BF P 2 meters plus V so in terms of derivatives with respect to time and space, acting this operator on the wave function psi immediately led Schrödinger to his equation I psi t equals minus 2 2 m 2 psi plus v psi Display style i h b a r d f r a c partial psi partial t equals d f r a c h b a r caret two two meters nabla caret two psi plus v psi. Wave particle duality can be assessed from these equations as follows. The kinetic energy t is related to the square of momentum p. As the particle's momentum increases, the kinetic energy increases more rapidly. But since the wave number k increases, the wavelength lambda decreases. In terms of ordinary scalar and vector quantities, not operators, p, p, k, k, t, one, lambda, two, display style math bf p c d o t math bf p propto math bf k c d o t math bf k propto t propto d f r a c one lambda caret two the kinetic energy is also proportional to the second spatial derivatives, so it is also proportional to the magnitude of the curvature of the wave. In terms of operators, t caret psi equals minus two two m psi two psi. Display style hat t psi equals frac h bar caret two two meters nabla c d o t nabla psi propto nabla caret two psi. As the curvature increases, the amplitude of the wave alternates between positive and negative more rapidly, and also shortens the wavelength. So the inverse relation between momentum and wavelength is consistent with the energy the particle has, and so the energy of the particle has a connection to a wave, all in the same mathematical formulation. Topic. Wave and particle motion 
Schrödinger required that a wave packet solution near position R with wave vector near K will move along the trajectory determined by classical mechanics for times short enough for the spread in K and hence in velocity not to substantially increase the spread in R. Since, for a given spread in K, the spread in velocity is proportional to Planck's constant h, it is sometimes said that in the limit as h approaches zero, the equations of classical mechanics are restored from quantum mechanics. Great care is required in how that limit is taken, and in what cases. The limiting short wavelength is equivalent to h tending to zero because this is limiting case of increasing the wave packet localization to the definite position of the particle see images right. Using the Heisenberg uncertainty principle for position and momentum, the products of uncertainty in position and momentum become zero as h zero. Sigma x sigma p x two sigma x sigma p x zero Display style sigma x sigma p underscore x gexlant frac h bar two quad right arrow quad sigma x sigma p underscore x gexlant zero, where sigma denotes the root mean square measurement uncertainty in x and p x, and similarly for the y and z directions, which implies the position and momentum can only be known to arbitrary precision in this limit. One simple way to compare classical to quantum mechanics is to consider the time evolution of the expected position and expected momentum, which can then be compared to the time evolution of the ordinary position and momentum in classical mechanics. The quantum expectation values satisfy the Ehrenfest theorem. For a one-dimensional quantum particle moving in a potential v, v the Ehrenfest theorem says m d D T X equals P D D T P equals minus V X display style M F R A C D D T Langle X Wrangle equals Langle P Wrangle quad F R A C D D T Langle P Wrangle equals left Langle V X right Wrangle although the first of these equations is consistent with the classical behavior the second is not if the pair X P display style Langle X Wrangle Langle P Wrangle were to satisfy Newton's second law, the right-hand side of the second equation would have to be minus v x display style v left left angle x right angle right, which is typically not the same as minus v x display style left angle v x right angle. In the case of the quantum harmonic oscillator, however, v display style v is linear and this distinction disappears so that in this very special case the expected position and expected momentum do exactly follow the classical trajectories for general systems the best we can hope for is that the expected position and momentum will approximately follow the classical trajectories if the wave function is highly concentrated around a point x 0 display style x underscore 0 then v x display style v left left angle x right angle right and v x display style left angle v x right angle will be almost the same since both will be approximately equal to v x 0 display style v x underscore 0 in that case, the expected position and expected momentum will remain very close to the classical trajectories, at least for as long as the wave function remains highly localized in position. When Planck's constant is small, it is possible to have a state that is well localized in both position and momentum. The small uncertainty in momentum ensures that the particle remains well localized in position for a long time, so that expected position and momentum continue to closely track the classical trajectories. The Schrödinger equation in its general form I T psi R T equals H 
Carrot Psi R T Display style I H B A R F R A C partial partial T psi left Math B F R T right equals hat H psi left Math B F R T right is closely related to the Hamilton Jacobi equation H J E minus T S Q I T equals H Q I S Q I T display style frac partial partial T S Q underscore I T equals H left Q underscore I frac partial S partial Q underscore I T right, where S is action and H is the Hamiltonian function, not operator. Here the generalized coordinates chi for i. Topic one two three used in the context of the HJE can be set to the position in Cartesian coordinates as r q one q two q three equals x y z substituting psi equals rho r T E I S R T display style psi equals s q r t rho math b f r t e caret is math b f r t h b a r, where rho is the probability density into the Schrödinger equation, and then taking the limit h zero in the resulting equation yields the Hamilton-Jacobi equation. The implications are as follows. The motion of a particle, described by a short wavelength wave packet solution to the Schrödinger equation, is also described by the Hamilton-Jacobi equation of motion. The Schrödinger equation includes the wave function, so its wave packet solution implies the position of a quantum particle is fuzzily spread out in wave fronts. On the contrary, the Hamilton-Jacobi equation applies to a classical particle of definite position and momentum, instead the position and momentum at all times the trajectory are deterministic and can be simultaneously known. <laughs> Nonrelativistic quantum mechanics The quantum mechanics of particles without accounting for the effects of special relativity, for example particles propagating at speeds much less than light, is known as nonrelativistic quantum mechanics. Following are several forms of Schrödinger's equation in this context for different situations, time independence and dependence, 1 and 3 spatial dimensions, and 1 and n particles. In actuality, the particles constituting the system do not have the numerical labels used in theory. The language of mathematics forces us to label the positions of particles one way or another, otherwise there would be confusion between symbols representing which variables are for which particle. <laughs> Time independent If the Hamiltonian is not an explicit function of time, the equation is separable into a product of spatial and temporal parts. In general, the wave function takes the form psi space chords t equals psi space chords tau t display style psi text space chords t equals psi text space chords tau t where psi space chords is a function of all the spatial coordinates of the particles constituting the system only, and tau t is a function of time only. Substituting for psi into the Schrödinger equation for the relevant number of particles in the relevant number of dimensions, solving by separation of variables implies the general solution of the time-dependent equation has the form psi space chords t equals psi Space chords E minus I E T display style psi text space chords T equals psi text space chords E caret I at H B A R. Since the time dependent phase factor is always the same, only the spatial part needs to be solved for in time independent problems. 
Additionally, the energy operator E equals I, T can always be replaced by the energy eigenvalue E, thus the time-independent Schrödinger equation is an eigenvalue equation for the Hamiltonian operator H caret psi equals E psi display style hat h psi equals e psi this is true for any number of particles in any number of dimensions in a time independent potential this case describes the standing wave solutions of the time dependent equation which are the states with definite energy instead of a probability distribution of different energies in physics these standing waves are called stationary states or energy eigenstates in chemistry they are called atomic orbitals or molecular orbitals superpositions of energy eigenstates change their properties according to the relative phases between the energy levels the energy eigenvalues from this equation form a discrete spectrum of values so mathematically energy must be quantized more specifically the energy eigenstates form a basis any wave function may be written as a sum over the discrete energy states or an integral over continuous energy states or more generally as an integral over a measure this is the spectral theorem in mathematics, and in a finite state space it is just a statement of the completeness of the eigenvectors of a Hermitian matrix. <laughs> One-dimensional examples For a particle in one dimension, the Hamiltonian is H caret equals P caret 2 2 m plus v x p caret equals minus i d d x display style hat h equals frac hat p caret 2 2 meters plus v x quad hat p equals i h bar frac d dx and substituting this into the general Schrödinger equation gives minus two two m d two d x two psi x plus v x psi x equals e psi X display style frac h bar caret two two meters frac d caret two dx caret two psi x plus v x psi x equals e psi x. This is the only case the Schrödinger equation is an ordinary differential equation rather than a partial differential equation. The general solutions are always of the form psi x t equals Psi x e minus i e t display style psi x t equals psi x e caret i e t h bar for n particles in one dimension the Hamiltonian is h caret equals n equals one N P carrot N two two M N plus V X one X two X N P carrot N equals minus I X N display style hat H equals sum underscore N equals one carrot N FRAC hat P underscore N carrot two two meters underscore N plus V X underscore one X underscore two C D O T S X underscore N quad hat P underscore N equals I H B A R FRAC partial partial X underscore N where the position of particle N is X N the corresponding Schrödinger equation is minus two two n equals 
1 n 1 m n 2 x n 2 psi x 1 x 2 x n plus v x 1 x 2 x n psi x 1 x 2 x n equals e psi x 1 x 2 x n Display style FRAC HBAR carrot two two sum underscore N equals one carrot N FRAC one M underscore N FRAC partial carrot two partial x underscore N carrot two psi x underscore one x underscore two C D O T S x underscore N plus V x underscore one x underscore two C D O T S x underscore N psi x underscore one x underscore two C D O T S x underscore Underscore N equals E psi x underscore one x underscore two C D O T S x underscore N. So the general solutions have the form psi x one x two x N T equals E minus I E T Psi x one x two x n display style psi x underscore one x underscore two c d o t s x underscore n t equals e caret i e t h b a r psi x underscore one x underscore two c d o t s x underscore n for non-interacting distinguishable particles, the potential of the system only influences each particle separately, so the total potential energy is the sum of potential energies for each particle V x 1 x 2 x n equals n equals 1 n V x N display style v x underscore one x underscore two c d o t s x underscore n equals sum underscore n equals one caret n v x underscore n, and the wave function can be written as a product of the wave functions for each particle. Psi x one x two x n t equals e minus i e t n equals 1 n psi x n Display style psi x underscore one x underscore two c d o t s x underscore n t equals e caret i at h b a r prod underscore n equals one caret n psi x underscore n. For non-interacting identical particles, the potential is still a sum, but wave function is a bit more complicated. It is a sum over the permutations of products of the separate wave functions to account for particle exchange. In general for interacting particles, the above decompositions are not possible. <inaudible> free particle For no potential, V equals zero, so the particle is free and the equation reads minus E psi equals 2 2 m d 2 psi d x 2 display style e psi equals frac h bar caret 2 2 meters d caret 2 psi over dx caret 2, which has oscillatory solutions for e greater than zero, the cn are arbitrary constants. Psi 
e x equals c 1 e i 2 m e 2 x plus c 2 e minus i 2 meters e 2 x display style psi underscore e x equals c underscore 1 e caret i sqrt 2 me h bar caret 2 x plus c underscore 2 e caret i sqrt 2 me h bar caret 2 x and exponential solutions for e psi minus e x equals c 1 e 2 meters e 2 x plus c 2 e minus 2 meters e 2 x display style psi underscore e x equals c under Score one e carrot sqrt two meters e h bar carrot two x plus c underscore two e carrot sqrt two meters e h bar carrot two x. The exponentially growing solutions have an infinite norm and are not physical. They are not allowed in a finite volume with periodic or fixed boundary conditions. See also free particle and wave packet for more discussion on the free particle. Topic. Constant potential For a constant potential, V equals V0, the solution is oscillatory for E greater than V0 and exponential for E. Equals. Topic. Harmonic oscillator equals. The Schrödinger equation for this situation is E psi equals minus 2 2 m d 2 d x 2 psi plus 1 2 m omega 2 x 2 psi Display style e psi equals frac h bar caret two two meters frac d caret two dx caret two psi plus frac one two m omega caret two x caret two psi. It is a notable quantum system to solve for, since the solutions are exact but complicated in terms of Hermite polynomials, and it can describe or at least approximate a wide variety of other systems, including vibrating atoms, molecules, and atoms or ions in lattices, and approximating other potentials near equilibrium points. It is also the basis of perturbation methods in quantum mechanics. There is a family of solutions, in the position basis they are psi n x equals 1 2 n n m omega pi 1 4 e minus m omega x 2 2 h n m omega X display style psi underscore n x equals sqrt frac one two caret n n c d o t left frac m omega pi h bar right caret one quarter c d o t e caret frac m omega x caret two two h bar c d o t h underscore n left sqrt frac m omega h bar x right where n equals 0, 1, 2 and the functions h n are the Hermite polynomials equals topic three dimensional examples equals the extension from one dimension to three dimensions is straightforward all position and momentum operators are replaced by their three dimensional expressions and the partial derivative with respect to space is replaced by the gradient operator the hamiltonian for one particle in three dimensions is h caret equals p caret p caret 2 m plus 
v r p caret equals minus i display style hat h equals frac hat math bf p c d o t hat math bf p two meters plus v math bf r quad hat math bf p equals i h bar nabla generating the equation minus two two m two psi r plus v r psi r equals e psi r display style frac h bar caret 2 2 meters nabla caret 2 psi math bf r plus v math bf r psi math bf r equals e psi math bf r with stationary state solutions of the form psi r t equals psi r e minus i e t display style psi math bf r t equals psi math bf r e caret i e t h bar where the position of the particle is r two useful coordinate systems for solving the schrodinger equation are cartesian coordinates so that r topic x y z and spherical polar coordinates so that r r theta phi although other orthogonal coordinates are useful for solving the equation for systems with certain geometric symmetries for n particles in 3 dimensions the hamiltonian is h caret equals n equals 1 n p caret n p caret n 2 m n plus v r 1 r 2 r n p caret n equals Minus i n display style hat h equals sum underscore n equals one caret n frac hat math bf p underscore n c d o t hat math bf p underscore n two meters underscore n plus v math bf r underscore one math bf r underscore two c d o t s math bf r underscore n quad hat math bf p underscore n equals i h bar nabla underscore n where the position of particle n is Rn and the gradient operators are partial derivatives with respect to the particle's position coordinates. In Cartesian coordinates, for particle n, the position vector is Rn equals xn, yn, zn, while the gradient and Laplacian operator are respectively n equals e x x n plus e y y n plus e z z n n 2 equals n n equals 2 x n 2 plus 2 y n 2 plus 2 z n 2 Display style nabla underscore n equals math bf e underscore x frac partial partial x underscore n plus math bf e underscore y frac partial partial y underscore n plus math bf e underscore z frac partial partial z underscore n quad nabla underscore n caret two equals nabla underscore n c d o t nabla underscore n equals frac partial caret two 
two partial x underscore n carrot two plus frac partial carrot two partial y underscore n carrot two plus frac partial carrot two partial z underscore n carrot two. The Schrödinger equation is minus two two n equals one n one m n n two psi r one r two r n plus v r one r two r n psi r one r two r n equals e psi r one r two r n Display style frac h bar caret two two sum underscore n equals one caret n frac one m underscore n nabla underscore n caret two psi math bf r underscore one math bf r underscore two c d o t s math bf r underscore n plus v math bf r underscore one math bf r underscore two c d o t s math bf r underscore n psi math b F R underscore one Math BF R underscore two C D O T S Math BF R underscore N equals E Psi Math BF R underscore one Math BF R underscore two C D O T S Math BF R underscore N with stationary state solutions Psi R one R two R N T equals E minus I E T psi R one R two R N Display style psi math bf r underscore one math bf r underscore two c d o t s math bf r underscore n t equals e caret i e t h b a r psi math bf r underscore one math bf r underscore two c d o t s math bf r underscore n. Again, for non-interacting distinguishable particles, the potential is the sum of particle potentials. V R one R two R N equals N equals one N V R N Display style V Math BF R underscore one Math BF R underscore two C D O T S Math BF R underscore N equals sum underscore N equals one carrot N V Math BF R underscore N and the wave function is a product of the particle wave functions Psi R one R two R N T equals e minus i e t n equals 1 n psi r n Display style psi math bf r underscore one math bf r underscore two c d o t s math bf r underscore n t equals e caret i et h b a r prod underscore n equals one caret n psi math bf r underscore n. For non-interacting identical particles, the potential is a sum, but the wave function is a sum over permutations of products. The previous two equations do not apply to interacting particles. Following are examples where exact solutions are known. See the main articles for further details. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Hydrogen atom. 
This form of the Schrödinger equation can be applied to the hydrogen atom. E psi equals minus two two mu two psi minus e two four pi epsilon zero r psi Display style e psi equals frac h bar caret two two mu nabla caret two psi frac e caret two four pi var epsilon underscore zero r psi, where e is the electron charge, r is the position of the electron relative to the nucleus, r equals r is the magnitude of the relative position. The potential term is due to the Coulomb interaction, wherein epsilon zero is the electric constant, permittivity of free space, and mu equals m e m p m e plus m p display style mu equals frac m underscore e m underscore p m underscore e plus m underscore p is the two body reduced mass of the hydrogen nucleus just a proton of mass m p and the electron of mass me the negative sign arises in the potential term since the proton and electron are oppositely charged. The reduced mass in place of the electron mass is used since the electron and proton together orbit each other about a common center of mass, and constitute a two-body problem to solve. The motion of the electron is of principal interest here, so the equivalent one-body problem is the motion of the electron using the reduced mass. The wave function for hydrogen is a function of the electron's coordinates, and in fact can be separated into functions of each coordinate. Usually this is done in spherical polar coordinates. Psi r theta phi equals r r y m theta phi equals r r Theta, theta, phi, phi. Display style psi r theta phi equals r r y underscore l caret m theta phi equals r r theta theta phi phi. Where r are radial functions and y m theta phi are spherical harmonics of degree and order m. This is the only atom for which the Schrödinger equation has been solved for exactly. Multi-electron atoms require approximative methods. The family of solutions are psi n m r theta phi equals 2 n a 0 3 n minus minus 1 2 n n plus e minus r n a 0 2 r n a 0 l n minus minus 1 2 plus 1 2 r n a 0 y m theta phi Display style psi underscore n l m r theta phi equals s q r t left frac two na underscore zero right caret three frac n l minus one two n n plus l e caret r na underscore zero left frac two r na underscore zero right caret l l underscore n l minus one caret two l plus one left frac two r na underscore zero right c d o t y underscore l L carrot m theta phi, where a zero equals four pi epsilon zero 
2 meters ee2 display style underscore 0 equals frac 4 pi var epsilon underscore 0 hbar caret 2 m underscore ee caret 2 is the bohr radius ln minus minus 1 2 plus 1 display style l underscore n l minus 1 caret 2 l plus 1 c d o t s are the generalized Laguerre polynomials of degree n minus minus 1 n, m are the principal, azimuthal, and magnetic quantum numbers respectively, which take the values, n equals 1, 2, 3, equals 0, 1, 2, n minus 1 meter equals minus, display style, begin, aligned, n and equals 1, 2, 3, dots, l and equals 0, 1, 2, dots, n1, m and equals, l, dots, l, end, aligned, n b, generalized Laguerre polynomials are defined differently by different authors, see main article on them and the hydrogen atom. Topic: Two electron atoms or ions. The equation for any two electron system, such as the neutral helium atom He, Z. Topic: Two, the negative hydrogen ion H minus Z. One, or the positive lithium ion Li plus Z equals three is E. Psi equals minus two one two mu one two plus two two plus one M one two Psi plus E two four Pi Epsilon zero one R twelve minus Z one R one plus one R two Psi Display style e psi equals h b a r caret two left frac one two mu left nabla underscore one caret two plus nabla underscore two caret two right plus frac one m nabla underscore one c d o t nabla underscore two right psi plus frac e caret two four pi var epsilon underscore zero left frac one r underscore twelve z left frac one r underscore one plus frac C one R underscore two right right psi where R one is the relative position of one electron R one Topic R one is its relative magnitude R two is the relative position of the other electron R two R2 is the magnitude R12 equals R12 is the magnitude of the separation between them given by R12 equals R2 minus R1 display style math bf r underscore 12 equals math bf r underscore 2 math bf r underscore 1 Mu is again the two-body reduced mass of an electron with respect to the nucleus of mass m, so this time mu equals m e m m e plus m display style mu equals frac m underscore e m m underscore e plus m, and z is the atomic number for the element, not a quantum number. The cross term of two Laplacians one M one two Display style FRAC one M Nabla underscore one C D O T Nabla underscore two is known as the mass polarization term, which arises due to the motion of atomic nuclei. The wave function is a function of the two electrons positions psi equals psi R one R two Display style psi equals psi Math BF R underscore one Math BF R underscore two There is no closed form solution for this equation.
Topic: <laughs> Time dependent. This is the equation of motion for the quantum state. In the most general form, it is written I T psi equals h caret psi display style i h bar frac partial partial t psi equals hat h psi and the solution the wave function is a function of all the particle coordinates of the system and time following are specific cases for one particle in one dimension the hamiltonian h caret equals p caret 2 2 m plus v x t p caret equals minus i x Display style hat h equals frac hat p caret two two meters plus v x t quad hat p equals i h bar frac partial partial x generates the equation i t psi x t equals minus two two m two x 2 psi x t plus v x t psi x t Display style i h bar frac partial partial t psi x t equals frac h bar caret two two meters frac partial caret two partial x caret two psi x t plus v x t psi x t. For n particles in one dimension, the Hamiltonian is h caret equals n equals one n p caret n 2 2 m n plus v x 1 x 2 x n t p caret n equals minus I x n display style hat h equals sum underscore n equals one caret n frac hat p underscore n caret two two meters underscore n plus v x underscore one x underscore two c d o t s x underscore n t quad hat p underscore n equals i h bar frac partial partial x underscore n where the position of particle n is x n, generating the equation i t psi x one x two x n t equals minus two two n equals one n one M N two X N two Psi X one X two X N T plus V X one X two X N T psi x one x two x n t 
display style i h b a r f r a c partial partial t psi x underscore one x underscore two c d o t s x underscore n t equals f r a c h b a r caret two two sum underscore n equals one caret n f r a c one m underscore n f r a c partial caret two partial x underscore n caret two psi x underscore one x underscore two c d o t s x underscore n T plus V x underscore one x underscore two C D O T S x underscore N T Psi x underscore one x underscore two C D O T S x underscore N T For one particle in three dimensions, the Hamiltonian is H carrot equals P carrot P carrot two M plus V R T P carrot equals minus I display style hat H equals frac hat math BF P C D O T hat math BF P two meters plus V math BF R T quad hat math BF P equals I H B A R nabla generating the equation T psi R T equals minus two two M two psi R T plus V R T psi R T Display style i h b a r f r a c partial partial t psi math b f r t equals f r a c h b a r caret two two meters nabla caret two psi math b f r t plus v math b f r t psi math b f r t. For n particles in three dimensions, the Hamiltonian is h caret equals n equals one N P carrot N P carrot N two M N plus V R one R two R N T P carrot N equals minus I N Display style hat H equals sum underscore N equals one carrot N F R A C hat Math B F P underscore N C D O T hat Math B F P underscore N two meters underscore N plus V Math B F R underscore one Math B F R underscore two C D O T S Math B F R underscore N T quad hat Math B F P underscore N equals I H B A R Nabla underscore N where the position of particle n is Rn, generating the equation I T psi R 1 R 2 R N T equals minus 2 2 N equals 1 N one M N N two Psi R one R two R N T plus V R one R two R N T Psi R one R two R N T 
Display style i h b a r f r a c partial partial t psi math b f r underscore one math b f r underscore two c d o t s math b f r underscore n t equals f r a c h b a r caret two two sum underscore n equals one caret n f r a c one m underscore n nabla underscore n caret two psi math b f r underscore one math b f r underscore two c d o t s math b f r underscore n t plus v math b f r underscore one math b f r underscore two c d o t s math b f r underscore n t psi math b f r underscore one math b f r underscore two c d o t s math b f r underscore n t this last equation is in a very high dimension so the solutions are not easy to visualize Topic. Solution methods Topic. Properties The Schrödinger equation has the following properties, some are useful, but there are shortcomings. Ultimately, these properties arise from the Hamiltonian used, and the solutions to the equation. Topic. Linearity In the development above, the Schrödinger equation was made to be linear for generality, though this has other implications. If two wave functions ψ1 and ψ2 are solutions, then so is any linear combination of the two. ψ equals a ψ1 plus b ψ 2 display style display style psi equals a psi underscore 1 plus b psi underscore 2 where a and b are any complex numbers the sum can be extended for any number of wave functions this property allows superpositions of quantum states to be solutions of the schrodinger equation even more generally it holds that a general solution to the schrodinger equation can be found by taking a weighted sum over all single state solutions achievable for example, consider a wave function psi x, t, such that the wave function is a product of two functions, one time independent, and one time dependent. If states of definite energy found using the time independent Schrödinger equation are given by psi e x with amplitude n and time dependent phase factor is given by e minus i e n t Display style e caret i e underscore n t h b a r. Then a valid general solution is psi x t equals n a n psi e n x e minus i e n t. Display style display style psi x t equals sum limits underscore n a underscore n psi underscore e underscore n x e caret i e underscore n t h b a r. Additionally, the ability to scale solutions allows one to solve for a wave function without normalizing it first. If one has a set of normalized solutions psi n, then psi equals n a n psi n display style display style psi equals sum limits underscore n a underscore n psi underscore n can be normalized by ensuring that n a n 2 equals 1 display style display style sum limits underscore n a underscore n caret 2 equals 1 this is much more convenient than having to verify that minus infinity infinity psi x 2 d x equals minus infinity infinity psi x psi x d x equals 
1 display style display style int limits underscore in a t carrot in a t psi x carrot 2 DX equals int limits underscore in a t carrot in a t psi x psi carrot asterisk X DX equals 1 topic momentum space Schrodinger equation the Schrodinger equation I T psi equals h caret psi display style i h b a r partial underscore t psi wrangle equals hat h psi wrangle is often presented in the position basis form i t psi x equals minus two two M two psi x plus v x psi x display style i h b a r partial underscore t psi x equals frac h b a r caret two two meters nabla caret two psi x plus v x psi x with x psi Psi x display style wrangle x psi wrangle equiv psi x, but as a vector operator equation, it has a valid representation in any arbitrary complete basis of Ketz in Hilbert space. For example, in the momentum space basis, the equation reads i t f p equals p two two M F P plus V tilde F P display style display style I H B A R partial underscore T F P equals F R A C P carrot two two meters F P plus tilde V asterisk F P where P display style P wrangle is the plane wave state of definite momentum p display style p p psi f p equals psi x e minus i p x d x Display style wrangle p psi wrangle equiv f p equals int psi x e caret i p x d x v tilde display style tilde v is the Fourier transform of v display style v and display style asterisk denotes Fourier convolution. In the 1D example with absence of a potential, v tilde equals zero. Display style tilde v equals zero, or similarly, v tilde k delta k. Display style tilde v k propto delta k. In the case of a background potential constant throughout space, each stationary state of energy omega equals q two two m display style h bar omega equals q caret two two meters is of the form f q p equals c plus delta p minus q plus c minus delta p plus q e minus i omega t Display style f underscore q p equals c underscore plus delta p q plus c underscore delta p plus q e caret i omega t for arbitrary complex coefficients c plus or minus display style c underscore p m 
Such a wave function, as expected in free space, is a superposition of plane waves moving right and left with momenta plus or minus q PMQ. Upon momentum measurement the state would collapse to one of definite momentum plus or minus q PMQ. with probability c plus or minus 2 Display style propto c underscore pm caret two. A version of the momentum space Schrödinger equation is often used in solid state physics, as Bloch's theorem ensures the periodic crystal lattice potential couples f p. Display style f p with f p plus k. Display style f p plus k. For only discrete reciprocal lattice vectors k, k, this makes it convenient to solve the momentum space Schrödinger equation at each point in the Brillouin zone independently of the other points in the Brillouin zone. Topic: <laughs> Real energy eigenstates. For the time-independent equation, an additional feature of linearity follows, if two wave functions ψ1 and ψ2 are solutions to the time-independent equation with the same energy E, then so is any linear combination H caret a ψ1 plus b ψ2 equals a h caret psi 1 plus b h caret psi 2 equals e a psi 1 plus b psi 2 Display style hat h a psi underscore one plus b psi underscore two equals a hat h psi underscore one plus b hat h psi underscore two equals e a psi underscore one plus b psi underscore two. Two different solutions with the same energy are called degenerate in an arbitrary potential. If a wave function psi solves the time-independent equation, so does its complex conjugate, denoted psi asterisk. By taking linear combinations, the real and imaginary parts of ψ are each solutions. If there is no degeneracy they can only differ by a factor. In the time-dependent equation, complex conjugate waves move in opposite directions. If ψ x t is one solution, then so is ψ asterisk x t. The symmetry of complex conjugation is called time-reversal symmetry. Space and time derivatives The Schrödinger equation is first order in time and second in space, which describes the time evolution of a quantum state meaning it determines the future amplitude from the present. Explicitly for one particle in three-dimensional Cartesian coordinates, the equation is I psi t equals minus 2 2 m 2 psi x 2 plus 2 psi y 2 plus 2 psi z 2 plus v x y z t Psi Display style I H B A R partial psi over partial T equals H B A R carrot two over two meters left partial carrot two psi over partial x carrot two plus partial carrot two psi over partial y carrot two plus partial carrot two psi over partial z carrot two right plus V x y z T psi the first time partial derivative implies the initial value at t equals zero of the wave function psi x y z zero display style psi x y z zero 
is an arbitrary constant. Likewise, the second-order derivatives with respect to space implies the wave function and its first-order spatial derivatives psi x b y b z b t x psi x b y b z b T Y Psi X B Y B Z B T Z psi x b y b z b t display style begin aligned and psi x underscore b y underscore b z underscore b t and frac partial partial x psi x underscore b y underscore b z underscore b t quad frac partial partial y psi x underscore b y underscore b z underscore b t quad frac partial partial z psi Y x underscore b y underscore b z underscore b t end aligned are all arbitrary constants at a given set of points, where x b y b z b are a set of points describing boundary b. Derivatives are evaluated at the boundaries. Typically, there are one or two boundaries, such as the step potential and particle in a box, respectively. As the first order derivatives are arbitrary, the wave function can be a continuously differentiable function of space, since at any boundary the gradient of the wave function can be matched. On the contrary, wave equations in physics are usually second order in time. Notable are the family of classical wave equations and the quantum Klein Gordon equation. <laughs> Local conservation of probability The Schrödinger equation is consistent with probability conservation. Multiplying the Schrödinger equation on the right by the complex conjugate wave function, and multiplying the wave function to the left of the complex conjugate of the Schrödinger equation, and subtracting, gives the continuity equation for probability t rho r t plus j equals 0 Display style partial over partial t row left math bf r t right plus nabla c d o t math bf j equals zero, where row equals psi two equals psi r t psi r t Display style row equals psi caret two equals psi caret asterisk math bf r t psi math bf r t is the probability density probability per unit volume asterisk denotes complex conjugate and j equals one two m psi p caret psi Minus psi p caret psi display style math bf j equals one over two meters left psi caret asterisk hat math bf p psi psi hat math bf p psi caret asterisk right is the probability current flow per unit area. Hence, predictions from the Schrödinger equation do not violate probability conservation. Topic. Positive energy If the potential is bounded from below, meaning there is a minimum value of potential energy, the eigenfunctions of the Schrödinger equation have energy which is also bounded from below. This can be seen most easily by using the variational principle, as follows, see also below. For any linear operator a bounded from below, the eigenvector with the smallest eigenvalue is the vector psi that minimizes the quantity psi a caret psi display style langle psi hat a psi wrangle over all psi which are normalized in this way the smallest eigenvalue is expressed through the variational principle 
For the Schrödinger Hamiltonian H bounded from below, the smallest eigenvalue is called the ground state energy. That energy is the minimum value of psi h caret psi equals psi r minus two two m two psi r plus v r psi r d three R equals two two M psi two plus V R psi two D three R equals H carrot Display style Langle psi hat H psi wrangle equals int psi carrot asterisk math BF R left FRAC H BAR carrot two two meters nabla carrot two psi math BF R plus V math BF R psi math BF R right D carrot three math BF R equals int left FRAC H BAR carrot two two meters nabla psi carrot two plus V math BF R psi carrot two right D carrot three math BF R equals Langle hat H wrangle using integration by parts. Due to the complex modulus of psi 2, which is positive definite, the right hand side is always greater than the lowest value of V x. In particular, the ground state energy is positive when V x is everywhere positive. For potentials which are bounded below and are not infinite over a region, there is a ground state which minimizes the integral above. This lowest energy wave function is real and positive definite, meaning the wave function can increase and decrease, but is positive for all positions. It physically cannot be negative, if it were, smoothing out the bends at the sign change to minimize the wave function rapidly reduces the gradient contribution to the integral and hence the kinetic energy, while the potential energy changes linearly and less quickly. The kinetic and potential energy are both changing at different rates, so the total energy is not constant, which can't happen conservation. The solutions are consistent with Schrödinger equation if this wave function is positive definite. The lack of sign changes also shows that the ground state is nondegenerate, since if there were two ground states with common energy E, not proportional to each other, there would be a linear combination of the two that would also be a ground state resulting in a zero solution. Topic. Analytic continuation to diffusion The above properties positive definiteness of energy allow the analytic continuation of the Schrödinger equation to be identified as a stochastic process. This can be interpreted as the Huygens-Fresnel principle applied to de Broglie waves, the spreading wavefronts are diffusive probability amplitudes. For a free particle not subject to a potential in a random walk, substituting tau equals it into the time-dependent Schrödinger equation gives tau x r tau equals 2 m 2 x r tau x r tau equals psi R tau i display style partial over partial tau x math bf r tau equals frac h bar two meters nabla caret two x math bf r tau quad x math bf r tau equals psi math bf r tau i which has the same form as the diffusion equation with diffusion coefficient h two meters. It is also revealed that the diffusion equation yields the Schrödinger equation in accordance with the Markov process. In that case, the relation of de Broglie is reasonably derived from the correlation between diffusivities, regardless of the photon energy. Thus, the relation is now not a hypothesis but an actual one expressing the nature of microparticle. Regularity. On the space L two display style L caret two of square integrable densities, the Schrödinger semigroup E 
I T H caret display style e caret it hat h is a unitary evolution and therefore surjective. The flows satisfy the Schrödinger equation. I T U equals H caret U display style I partial underscore T U equals wide hat H U where the derivative is taken in the distribution sense. However, since h caret display style wide hat h for most physically reasonable Hamiltonians, e.g., the Laplace operator, possibly modified by a potential, is unbounded in l two display style l caret two. This shows that the semigroup flows lack Sobolev regularity in general. Instead, solutions of the Schrödinger equation satisfy a Strichert's estimate. Topic: Relativistic quantum mechanics. Relativistic quantum mechanics is obtained where quantum mechanics and special relativity simultaneously apply. In general, one wishes to build relativistic wave equations from the relativistic energy-momentum relation. E two equals p c two plus M zero C two two display style e caret two equals P C caret two plus M underscore zero C caret two caret two instead of classical energy equations. The Klein-Gordon equation and the Dirac equation are two such equations. The Klein-Gordon equation one C two two T two psi minus two psi plus m two c two two psi equals zero. Display style frac one c caret two frac partial caret two partial t caret two psi nabla caret two psi plus frac m caret two c caret two h bar caret two psi equals zero was the first such equation to be obtained, even before the non-relativistic one, and applies to massive spinless particles. The Dirac equation arose from taking the square root of the Klein-Gordon equation by factorizing the entire relativistic wave operator into a product of two operators, one of these is the operator for the entire Dirac equation. Entire Dirac equation beta m c 2 plus c n equals 1 3 alpha n p N psi equals I psi T display style left beta mic carrot two plus C left sum underscore N mathip equals one carrot three alpha underscore N P underscore N right right psi equals I H B A R F R A C partial psi partial T the general form of the Schrödinger equation remains true in relativity, but the Hamiltonian is less obvious. For example, the Dirac Hamiltonian for a particle of mass m and electric charge q in an electromagnetic field described by the electromagnetic potentials phi and a is h caret Dirac equals gamma zero c gamma p Carrot minus Q A plus M C two plus Gamma zero Q Phi Display style hat H underscore text Dirac equals gamma carrot zero left C bold symbol gamma C D O T left hat Math BF P Q Math BF a right plus M C carrot two plus gamma carrot zero Q five right 
in which the gamma equals gamma 1, gamma 2, gamma 3 and gamma 0 are the Dirac gamma matrices related to the spin of the particle. The Dirac equation is true for all spin 1 half particles and the solutions to the equation are four component spinner fields with two components corresponding to the particle and the other two for the antiparticle. For the Klein-Gordon equation, the general form of the Schrödinger equation is inconvenient to use, and in practice the Hamiltonian is not expressed in an analogous way to the Dirac Hamiltonian. The equations for relativistic quantum fields can be obtained in other ways, such as starting from a Lagrangian density and using the Euler-Lagrange equations for fields, or use the representation theory of the Lorentz group in which certain representations can be used to fix the equation for a free particle of given spin and mass. In general, the Hamiltonian to be substituted in the general Schrödinger equation is not just a function of the position and momentum operators and possibly time, but also of spin matrices. Also, the solutions to a relativistic wave equation, for a massive particle of spin s, are complex-valued 2 2s plus 1 component spinner fields. <laughs> Quantum field theory The general equation is also valid and used in quantum field theory, both in relativistic and non-relativistic situations. However, the solution ψ is no longer interpreted as a wave, but should be interpreted as an operator acting on states existing in a Fox space. Topic: <laughs> First order form. The Schrödinger equation can also be derived from a first order form similar to the manner in which the Klein-Gordon equation can be derived from the Dirac equation. In 1D the first order equation is given by This equation allows for the inclusion of spin in nonrelativistic quantum mechanics. Squaring the above equation yields the Schrödinger equation in 1D. The matrices eta display style eta obey the following properties. The three-dimensional version of the equation is given by here eta equals gamma zero plus i gamma five two display style eta equals gamma underscore zero plus i gamma underscore five sqrt two is a four times four Display style four times four null potent matrix and gamma i display style gamma underscore i are the Dirac gamma matrices i equals one two three display style i equals one two three the Schrödinger equation in three D can be obtained by squaring the above equation. In the non-relativistic limit, e minus m e display style e m simic e and e plus m two m display style e plus m simic two meters, the above equation can be derived from the Dirac equation. See also equals equals notes. <laughs>